the flyover of B-52 bombers and flags solemnly lowered to half-mast, hundreds of local and military residents gathered to commemorate Memorial Day during a ceremony at the Guam Veterans Cemetery in Petey, May 27. Guam National Guard Adjutant General Major General Esther Agagi reminded the crowd not to forget the sacrifices of fallen service members and their Gold Star families and to thank them when opportunities arise. Every last Monday in May, we find ourselves reflecting on those who left the comforts of home to fight for us and our freedom. When their country called, they answered. But no matter how they found their way into the ranks of the military, each took it upon him or herself to serve faithfully and to their fullest. To our men and women in uniform, to our fallen and those who continue to fight, thank you from the bottom of our hearts. Your service is noble. You are our heroes. And as your governor representing the people of Guam, we stand here with honor with respect and with pride in commemoration of you and in support of your families. The ceremony proceeded with a series of wreath presentations from Agigi, Rear Admiral Shoshana Chatfield, Commander Joint Region Marianas, Colonel Matthew Nicholson, Vice Commander of 36th Wing, Captain Christopher Chase, Commander of U.S. Coast Guard Sector Guam, Major Samuel Dabney from Marine Corps Activity Guam, and members from various Guam veteran associations. Service members also presented a gun salute and taps. For Joint Region Marianas, I'm Alana Chargoloff.